the video game to the series, what did you learn about yourself as an actor? Well, I mean, I, I think that I think that in a in a video game, you have to be able to do everything that an actor in a theater would do. It takes your entire body, your entire voice, your entire performance has to be uh, uh, <laughs> has to be uh, at sort of a, 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 the caliber of great theater. And so, the transfer into TV and film is is not a, a leap at all. When you first read the script for your character, what were some of your initial thoughts about what you were going to bring to the role? When I read it, I read it sort of the script as a whole. They sent me two scripts, and I thought they were two of the best scripts that I have read in my entire life. And I thought, I'll come carry a spear on this thing and stand in the background. Uh, but when I sort of the breadth of what they wanted me to do really sort of uh, hit home, I, I just was humbled and honored and, 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 and proud that they chose me. Amazing. My last question for you is going to be, what's been the most rewarding part about being a part of this story? Well, for a long time, the satisfaction was just being in the game and, the, you know, the sort of uh, a family of Naughty Dog and working together. And more recently, I've met a lot of people who played the game 10 years ago and had their entire sort of worldview shaped by the mythology in the game. And that is a really powerful experience um, to, to meet people who've been touched by it that much. What did you learn about yourself as an actor when filming the series? Holy shit, what a great question. Um, everybody wants to know, like, I've, I've gotten very comfortable in doing video games, and oddly enough, I'm very comfortable in a mocap suit. Uh, it's been a long time since I've been on a set and never been on a set as big as this. Uh, so I did feel a lot of the pressure. Um, I was supported by an incredible cast and an incredible crew. Um, but acting is acting, and so it was, it was good to know that I could still stand up on my own two feet and do it there as well. What would you say was the most challenging part of the process, since going off what you just said? Specifically with my episode? There's a stunt that I did that I'm damn proud of if they use it. And if they cut me and use a stunt actor, I will 100% understand why, but I still did it at least <laughs> once. And my last question for you, what would you say is your favorite part about being a part of this series? Honestly, it's been in the last decade, um, hearing the stories from people who have played the game, who have experienced the story in one way or another, and hearing how it's impacted them and I think it's those people that we're making this the most for, but it's also for that whole new audience that has no idea what this story is about. I'm excited to see it in their hands and to hear what stories they're gonna share now. During the gameplay, was there a particular scene that you were excited to recreate or expand on when writing the series? Yes, um, for sure. I don't wanna to get too spoilery about it, but I will say that, generally speaking, the moments from the game that I was excited about recreating in terms of gameplay were character moments. One of the things that Naughty Dog does so well as a video game company is they put story in the non-cutscene areas into gameplay. And there are a few of those moments where Neil and I sometimes were doing it just like the game. Sometimes we took the spirit of the moment and expanded a little bit. Those were the things that got me the most excited. And my last question for you is, what was the most challenging from a writing perspective in maintaining the tone of the game but allowing it to stand on its own as a TV series? That's kind of the process of adaptation. And I had the benefit of Neil working with me, but the truth, the, I mean, the truest answer is I don't know. It just sort of happens. You know, like I follow my heart, I follow my instincts. I've been, you know, I've been doing it a long time. I'm trying to get better as I go. I, every project I do, I learn from it. Um, and for this one, I just brought everything I had, followed those instincts as best I could, and here we are. I'm sorry. This is like your baby, right? What, is, what does this moment mean for you, putting so many years into working on this? Uh, you know, it's, it's a lot of people's babies. Um, this thing is a massive collaboration for hundreds of people. When I started this process, I was thinking a lot about the people back at Naughty Dog that have dedicated years of their lives to bring that story to life as a video game. And as we started working on this process, and I got to meet this incredible crew, this incredible cast, that circle of the people I wanted to make proud has grown. And now it's like I want everybody that has worked on this show for years of their lives to be as proud of it, to love it as much as we do. 
One, que one last question for you. What are you excited the most for, for fans to see when they're witnessing the show for the first time? I think fans will have kind of a cool experience because there's things that they'll be very familiar with that they'll feel pride of. Like they were there from the very beginning when they played the game and they see it not realizing this other medium. But there's enough surprises there for them to be captivated by a new take, a new interpretation of this story and seeing it come to life in a different way, but also expand on the world and expand on some of the characters they are so familiar with in the video game.